Hey guys, so I'm really excited to do this video for you. It's all about my braces. So I got braces um, in December and it's almost February. So I've had them for almost over a month, almost two months. Um, I am so happy I got them. I used to have teeth that were overlapping each other and um, uh, on my top front two teeth. Um, well now, uh, they have a gap. There's a gap in my teeth already. It hasn't even been two months yet. My teeth have already gotten way straighter. I used to have like almost a snaggle tooth over on one side of my um, mouth and it's like completely gone now. I'm so excited that I got braces and I cannot wait to get perfectly straight teeth and white beautiful teeth. Um, so I can have a better smile. I know a lot of people are self-conscious about their smiles. I know I was. I didn't really smile with my teeth. I was just, you know, I didn't feel comfortable like that. Um, but now I think I suit my braces pretty nicely. I'm getting ready to have the wire changed out, I guess, um, next week, this week, somewhere around there. Um... They, for a few frequently asked questions that a lot of people ask me if they're going to get braces or like just out of the like blue. They're just like, well, does it hurt? No, the process does not hurt at all, okay? A lot of people are like, oh my god, it feels like something's just like driving in your teeth. And no, it doesn't feel anything like that. Um, I know where I go to the orthodontist, I'm not going to share where um, I go, but I know definitely most orthodontic um, assistants and stuff, they're definitely really, really friendly and nice because they know that this is probably a really nerve-wracking thing you're thinking about the day you're going to get braces. I know I was really nervous when I got braces. Um, it's really not that big of a deal. If you just take it like leisurely, not really thinking about it, um, just kind of talk with your assistant if they're really friendly. Even if they're not as friendly, maybe just try to like make a little uh, conversation. Sorry, I got a text. Okay, anyways. Um, but it's, I think the people that helped me out and the orthodontist um, himself was really friendly. I really liked the experience in my opinion. Basically, first of all, sometimes you'll need x-rays, sometimes you won't. Um, they'll take like pictures of your teeth um, and stuff like that. And then they do a thing where they mold the like structure of your teeth before you get the braces on. So they know what your teeth look like before and if they have made any progress after. Now, I'm not sure if they do the molds after you get the braces off, too, but um, I know they do them before. They're not the most comfortable thing in the world. Uh, you're going to probably feel like, what the heck are they putting in my mouth when you get them in? It's basically like, if anyone has had hummus before, it's basically like a pasty hummus texture, and they put it, it's like a mold process that dries uh, over like 30 seconds and they take this mold like pretend this is the mold okay and they like shove it up into your mouth and they shove it below your mouth don't move don't swallow and don't gag I know you might feel like that but if you just take deep breaths through it's gonna be perfectly fine um, they might have to redo it uh, if you gag or swallow or something that makes the mold move and it might still be a little bit on your teeth and stuff if they take it out and have to redo it. That's fine, just ask to go rinse your mouth out. And once it's done, it feels a lot better than it <laughs> when you were having that mold stuck in your teeth. But anyways, um, that was basically the most nerve-wracking part of my process. I was like, oh, I do not want those molds on. No, no, no. But once it was over, it was perfectly fine. The actual braces process, they basically put a little shampoo almost for your teeth onto your teeth and then you rinse it off and then they uh, hold your like the sides of your lips back and they basically start gluing the brackets on and they use a light which if you hold your mouth, 
mouth open with the light for a little while. It kind of gets you like a sour feeling when you close your mouth. But don't worry about that. Once you swallow or like use mouthwash, it goes away perfectly fine. Then they put the wire in and they put the colors on to keep the wire in place. And they bend the wires in so they don't scratch your mouth up. They give you uh, like some tips and tricks, some wax. Um, you won't really need wax, but that's basically the whole process of getting braces. And then um, once you go home and after a few days, it'll kind of feel a little sore. Um, but you can definitely see the process of your teeth moving over the week. Like if you take a picture right when you got them on and like two weeks later, it's already had a change. And I really thought that was impressive. I really liked it. And they will be sore when you get like your wires changed out just because um, it's going to, the teeth are going to be moving at a faster pace because they've obviously been replaced. Um, now, I only have my top braces on right now, but I'm going to get my bottom braces on in a few weeks. Those are basically everything of the process of braces. As far as what to eat, make sure you don't eat anything chewy, nothing too crunchy, or like any like type of like lollipop that if you have the habit of crunching on lollipops or Jolly Ranchers, I wouldn't recommend eating them. Definitely no Starburst or like caramel. Um... Anything else? Popcorn is not so good unless you have braces like mine, which I don't have my braces all the way back in my teeth, but if you have them just on like the front six or seven and you eat just a little bit of popcorn um, and try to get the kernels out and just chew it in the very back of your mouth, you can do that for a little bit, but do not try it any other way because you don't want to stop the braces process like when you mess it up or break a bracket breaking a bracket if you eat something that you're not supposed to or your touch braces too much um, the bracket can break off maybe because the glue didn't dry right or maybe just because you were too harsh on your teeth um, with your eating habits um, just call up the orthodontist and they should be able to replace the bracket. Um, if the wire falls out, they'll definitely tell you tips like that. Um, but other than that, be safe while eating. Make sure you brush and floss um, at least twice a day. Um, flossing does take a little while, but trust me, you do want to floss because you don't want gross teeth when you get your braces off. You don't want like straight teeth and then like gross colored teeth because that just doesn't look attractive. Um, basically those are the basics to braces. You shouldn't be worried at all about getting your braces on. I am so excited to get them off because I get them off right around a year from now. Um, yeah, basically, uh, comment down below any other suggestions you have and I'll talk to you soon. Love you guys. Bye.